Good morning and welcome to the Scotiabank Arena in Toronto, Canada. We found our entrance for the first of the barrier. We've got premium entrance C. We, uh, we've had some issues getting here. We got a flat tire on the way and uh, we took a wrong turn when we were supposed to get in here. So we uh, took a little longer than we expected to. We've got a train station over here. And uh, yeah, we're just getting settled in. It's not as cold as it was in Detroit, which is good. So I have to take a layer off every couple hours here. But yeah, this is gonna be a good day, good show. All right, we are currently at Union Station looking for some food and bathrooms for our day at the Scotiabank Arena, better known as the Air Canada Center. And a little fun fact about this venue is if you watch Flight 666, the very last song in the set list is Hallowed Be Thy Name, and it was recorded for that DVD at this venue. So being from England, I'm uh, quite, quite prone to curry, so this is uh, right up my alley. It's basically just bread filled with chicken curry, so yes. Yeah. <laughs> Sun's come out, so we're taking a little stroll. A couple blocks away, we've got the Ripley's Aquarium of Canada and the CN Tower, which is massive. We did stop by here in uh, 2019, but we didn't go up it. We're still not gonna go up it because it's too much money, but it's still cool to be here. So today's area that we were told to wait is uh, very loud. As you can see, we have a very busy room. It's been busy all day. Lots of uh, construction vehicles going through, banging around, and also the door area that we were asked to wait at is uh, also very small and cramped, as you can see over here as well. Okay. We just found the merch trailer, and voila, we have a Canada shirt. <laughs> Canadian event shirts, which are probably the best Canadian shirt I've seen so far. And these were 60 Canadian, which is actually 43 US dollars, which is awesome because all the uh, the t-shirts in the US have been $50. So great savings. I didn't tell myself I wasn't going to buy any more merch now that the, um, the Future Pass Tour has been announced. But, but we uh, didn't expect this shirt. So. I can't, yeah, I can't pass this up. This was one of the best this tour. So it's I'm great. <laughs> We had just lined up inside much later than usual. Oh, the big reveal. Oh, to the right. Middle? Damn, middle. Uh -huh. Okay.
It's great. One, to be back in Toronto. And two, it's great to be back in Toronto. Inside. Not on a fucking boating lake sponsored by a shit beer company, alright? So here we are, all of you, all of us, after weird fucking three years. It wasn't just a bad dream. Well, the bad dream, if you woke up today and you've been asleep for the last three years, I'm not even going to go there. It wasn't worth it. What happened the last three years is bad shit. And it stops right here, right now, tonight, with you. We got Mexicans, we got Brazilians, we got Chileans. Seriously, we're family, right? We're family. We don't, we don't actually give a fuck where you come from. In, in nice as that may be. Um, we don't care who your daddy was. We don't care how much money you got. The only thing that matters to us is that you, you come here and you respect each other and we all love each other and we have a great, great fucking night. wishing to enter, enter any of this woke bullshit, right? If I could just generically say that if we could all use the same fucking toilet, I could all call you brothers. I could call us all fucking blood
What an incredible show that was. Incredible. Toronto is awesome. Good morning and welcome to Hamilton, Ontario. We got home at 2 a.m. and what's yeah. sleep? <laughs> we uh, well, we went to uh, eat. We had to go find some food because we were starving, and uh, so we ended up at a hookah bar called Hayes uh, in Mississauga. Mississauga, something like that. And uh, we ended up getting to the Airbnb. We luckily all had our own bedroom. It was a big house uh, in the suburbs, and. So we're gonna make this video double feature, and uh, we're gonna do these two shows because they're two nights in a row, and uh, yeah. So I mean, this is basically the the second night of Toronto. They just couldn't do two a, another night yeah. at that other arena, so they had to move over here, which is only thirty minutes away. Get a little shot of where we're hanging out today in the AM. Uh, it doesn't look like too big of an arena. Yeah, we've never been to this venue or this city before of Hamilton. Stay for me? Alright. Alright, this is pretty bad. Can we like... Yeah, we're supposed to... Let's do a normal one first. We'll all bunch together. And then... getting started lining up now getting close to going in today's gone so fast and here comes matt to talk about his favorite band oh Fozzy for sure yeah. going all the way around the corner i didn't realize there was this many people here already they put wristbands on us and they put us in a holding room which is just the box office so oh wow somebody stole the <laughs> somebody stole the poster <laughs> but also we have to talk about this Sal Volcano. Joe, please come back. Time to go. Different? Hmm. Oh, we're already here. Go right for it. We're staring right at them. What? Yeah. 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 Yeah.
been here with Iron Maiden ever. Well, some time ago, right, with, with the virtue of the left tour, but that doesn't, doesn't count for me, because I wasn't here. <laughs> so at the ripe old age of 64, I am a fucking Hamilton virgin.
The morning after breakfast is always the best. Yeah. On your left. Terminal three. Arrived. We appreciate all the driving. It's just gonna explode out like Jericho does. <laughs> Ready? I'm ready. Oh! <laughs> oh, we didn't even clear the fence. Oh, there we go.